that that just when we watch these, I mean, clearly, yeah, all these uh, pursuits, you know, these people, do, most of these suspects really don't seem to care about anything but uh, trying to get away. But you know, going the wrong way, going high speeds, you got. So there we go. Coming up on 18th Street. Yep, 18th Street. 210 freeways. Going to be here in just a moment. There's no on-ramp right here. But uh, if uh, Wanderlust was at home, uh, we'd be going right by her house. Right, Vinny? Yeah, but she's not home. She's, she's someplace else. But that doesn't mean her house is empty. Just leaving it at that. So at any rate, there we go. Just crossing over the 210. Making our way northbound. Still on Benson. Let me find out if the Simon Test knows the original one. Do we know the original one on this? Hit and run. Well, that ex somebody asking me if I can hear them. I can. Uh -oh. Not at that speed. Come on, you know that. Right. <clears throat> it's a big wide street though. They would this would be the uh this would be the one to do it, right? Hard turn right there. Seems like he's slowing down just a little bit. I can't hear the street name. We're getting in a very residential neighborhood though. He Pardon me? Oh CBS has us. Okay. Copy all. Seeing if I can join along on the Facebook. Maybe some of these uh, folks have some uh, insight on what's going on here. Sadly, there we go. He's going, he's not going 98 miles an hour, is he? No, that's a... Yeah, I was going to say that all these, unless he's thinking about going up into the canyon, which could be interesting. Yeah, I'm just saying. So maybe he's going to swing back around and get on to uh, San Gabriel. Well, if you think it's like watching sports, I can tell you that uh, that guy's driving a, a Toyota Corolla high speeds. Uh, original want hit and run. I'm wondering if uh, anything is, there's any damage there. Take a look at this. Look at this. This is what I'm talking about. Wrong side of the road, passing at high speeds on a curve. And and for what? I mean, really true. Whoa, hello, hello. And there you go. That's that Toyota Corolla working it, working it as hard as he can there. Just making a, made a left turn uh, there on 21st Street. Sat, a right turn, sorry about that. San Antonio Heights. San Antonio Heights. So this isn't San Antonio. This is San Antonio Heights. Uh, he's getting some distance on the ground unit, I guess, because they were, they were telling him to back off a little bit. Ran another stop sign right there. All right. Jed, I don't understand. If you drive like that, you should really calm down. Don't be driving like that, you know. Don't be driving like that. So continuing on here. Um, yeah, hard on the brakes once again. I wonder if he lives in this neighborhood. There's so many things to wonder about. Yeah, I know. He is not very Corolla faster than we thought. I don't know, Gio. Uh, I mean, I know it's moving along at a pretty good clip there, but he's hitting those brakes pretty hard. Hey, Debbie's watching with us. Hey, Deb. Uh, not really good with uh, with roads out here, but it. Yeah. Arctic. On to 26. I was going to say, is that even a road, or is that uh, somebody's personal property right there, or a fire road? Anyway, looks like we're getting up into neighborhoods up here. Very, very nice neighborhoods. Not saying that a Corolla couldn't live up here. Not saying that a suspect couldn't live up here. But this is uh, definitely. A really nice neighborhood for the homes.
Uh-oh, looks, like, uh, looks like possibly a dirt road with a dead end. Now what will he do? Up oh, there's a fence. Up, oh, he's turning into somebody's driveway. I don't think he knew that this is somebody's residence. I think. Yep, four houses on this and a private driveway. Uh, you're gonna have to make a U-turn, buddy. You're gonna have to go back and meet your fate. Uh, yeah, well, there you go. Oh, oh, this is gonna be interesting. How far can you get this Toyota Corolla before it gets stuck? That was a nice shot, Vinny. Beautiful shot. Man, that was a beautiful shot, though. Somebody, I just saw that somebody uh, was writing about the uh, about the heat being on and uh, meaning the temperatures are up out here, and they are in the pursuits. Pursuits are like look low hanging fruit, just falling out of the trees today. Yeah, I'm sure that I'm sure people in the neighborhood are like, "What's going on? Is that my Amazon drone dropping off stuff?" Yes, I do. <clears throat> Elderly gentleman in some sort of green outfit. The shortcut turned into a long cut. Yep, and Claire is doing the same thing I was doing. I was wondering if he was using GPS. He should have been listening to uh, to, to Siri and or Alexa or, you know, I, I, I call my navigation woman something else, but I, I don't want to lose my job. But her and I have a great relationship, though. We talk all the time. All right, doors open. I wonder if he's going to go for a little jog up the hill. That would be interesting to see. Stu, awesome name, great deal. Jacob, happy birthday. 14, that's awesome. 14, two more years, and you can be driving yourself. Unmarked streets and private drives, they're having a trouble with getting getting the officers over there. In what? Like he can't be seen from where he's at? I doubt it. The helicopter knows where he is. Okay, the officer's got to be getting closer. That's what he just said. Yeah. I hope he doesn't do anything yeah, stupid like try to put it in reverse and hit a hit a police, an officer's vehicle. Yep, yep, here we go. Let's see what happens here. <clears throat> uh, they just they just told him to they told him to wait. They told him just to wait there. Yep. But he did bring water. That's clever. Yep. <laughs> That's what the CHP said the same thing. He brought his bottle of water. <clears throat> oh, come on. They're letting him get way too up far up in the hills. How are they going to catch him? Come on, guys. Oh, look, he's coming back down. That's a smart move. Just sit on the rock and wait. There's That's a nice rock. Just sit there. There you go. There you go. No, he's not. Oh, come on. What are you doing? Yeah. He's looking for a place to hide. He's going to blend in. Oh, don't go, don't go into the bushes. Don't, don't, don't go into. You're going to get thorns in your socks, and, and it's going to be all painful, and, you know. You might, you might get poison oak. Yeah, he, he did. Now they're going to wait for the canine. We don't have time for canine. Come on, guys. Get this guy into custody. Ah. It's too hot to go for a hike. It's just too hot. Oh, he, I see him moving around. I saw him. He's still he's still right there. Oh, they have a canine here already? Yeah, but they usually have something on the uh it doesn't say anything? Yeah, because they're just saying they're, they're going to make the announcement about the canine right now. Yeah.
Oh, yeah, there's a, uh, well, he's he's in that he's in that little uh, tuff of trees. He's in his tuffet, sitting on his tuffet, uh, drinking his water without his curds and ways. But anyways, uh, California Highway Patrol are down by the vehicle right now. I don't blame Vinny for not uh, not moving off. Oh, there you go. Yeah, you got it. There you go. So, and then you got the California Highway Patrol. I don't know if that one has the dog. It made him sound like he had the dog, but, oh, look at canine right there. There you go. There you go. Let the dog out. Come on. Who let the dog out? That guy's not letting him out. Yeah. Yep. And, and, you know, that's the thing, too. You just, you know, I'm worried about that guy getting, you know, his burrs in his socks. I mean, you're going to get those burrs in that in his fur. Yeah. So. Come on. I swear they should name one of those uh, canine unit dogs Pepper Balls. Be like, hey, Pepper Ball. Uh, no, it's what? It's the that little tuffet right there. We got a bunch of officers are getting there right now. Uh, this is gonna take forever. Is that is that the scanner or is that the desk saying? Can you copy? All right, they're just trying to guide more people in. Yeah, right now, he's probably in that, yeah. No, we, last time we saw him was just some shadows, but he, he hasn't really left the tuffet, so. Yeah. Well, April, it's the same thing. I mean, that guy's probably got thorns in his socks. You don't want to get those thorns in the dog. Yeah, that dog is going to catch up to him quick, though. Karen, I agree with you, but I don't think he does. He, the, the, we hadn't heard anything about that, the suspect being armed or anything like that. The only thing we know about the suspect, the hit and run, was what that vehicle was wanted for. Uh, yeah, let's just say uh, a guy got out of the car and, and went for a walk. I'm just saying that because, I mean, he wasn't like, you know, healthy or unhealthy looking. He was just your average guy. He did take a bottle of water, though, so it does seem like he's hunkering down for a little bit. Huh? Yeah, her name was Karen. Karen asked what was going on right there, so that's the reason why. Not, no, not like that. No, no. I didn't see him put his mask on. Somebody was asking about that. I don't know. I don't know. I, yeah, yeah, oh, yeah. He's still talking. Right. So, the bushes are moving like scenes from Jurassic Park. That's pretty funny. Yep, he's right in there somewhere with his little bottle of water resting, waiting to meet the dog. Are they they're, they're already going up the hill? That was quick. Come on, guys. Oh, you know what? This this might work out well. Come on. Let's go do it. Oh, come on. Leave the car alone. Woo! I wonder if that's one of those Belgium uh, whatevers, or because it doesn't look like a... Yeah, what, what's it called? Melanois? Malinois? All right. Adam knows everything. Between Adam and Vinny, I... I you know what? Uh, who needs the Internet? Anyways... Yeah, that's. Uh, I think that's what that is right there. They're pretty freaking cool dogs. That is for sure. Amazing. Yep. They want to find that toy. Yeah, he's got the long leash on him, so I don't think they're just going to let him go. Meaning the dog, not the suspect. Yeah. Thank you, Louise. 
I got you at Melanois. Yep. Ground media. Who's who's on the ground? Are you kidding me? Oh my god. You've got to be kidding me. Oh, this is embarrassing. Albuquerque. Yeah, long leash, right? Yeah. I don't think that's enough. Uh, yeah, keep going. Keep going, guys. You're nowhere near it. Keep going. There's a, they're telling, you say there's a boulder? Yeah. Go to the, go to the rock, because he should have stayed at the rock. Debbie Kickbush asked me, does Adam really know everything? I don't know, Deb. I don't know, Deb. I can't answer that. I know Vinny does. I know Vinny does. So. Yep. Belgium Mountain. Bel Belgium Malawas. Yeah. So th this guy's saying it's not a tough it. It's, it's, it's shrubbery. It's a lot of shrubbery. Yeah. It's a growth. It's a little spot that when we watch a brush fire, this is where, there you go, oh, look, push in. Oh, this is going to be great. Oh, no, he went back already. He's like, I don't know. It's hot. It's hot. There's, there's thorns. It's getting in my feet. Uh-huh. Anne Marie is uh, concerned that the uh, suspect is armed. Is he? Oh, there he goes. Oh, he's making his run. Is it? Oh, the dog got him. Oh, oh, that must be painful. Oh, I love that. K9 is making contact, helping the suspect to comply. There we go. Uh, yep. Uh, so. Just so you guys know, I, I, I'm being serious about this. They, uh, they've, uh, they, the, the helicopter was making announcements earlier on, and in those announcements, they don't say the dog might bite you. They say the dog will bite you. Oh yeah, the dog will bite you. So you know, they, they the suspects really have heads up, and uh, you know, somebody might say, oh, they're just going to say that, but, uh, but at any rate, yep, I guess that dog bit him. Nom nom. There you go. Wendy's. Yeah. Canine deployed. Yep. There we go. Now they need a. Now they need an ambulance. Yeah. <laughs> yep. Yep, the fur missile got him in the end. Oh! Yeah. He's probably saying, keep the dog away from me. Keep the dog away from me. I'm almost positive that's what he's saying right now. Yeah, they're going to get him into custody and get him out of there. Yeah. Those are amazing dogs, by the way. Yeah. Why would you wrestle with them? Dude, come on. You just got bit by a dog, and you got two officers from the CHP. Yep. Yep, there you go. Yeah. Oh, Gabby, he's a little too late. That dog is, yeah, really wants to.